Hello again, it is April 2016 or 2016, however you want to call it, and WrestleCrate UK has arrived, which means Steve's here. Hello. So, what's in the crate this time, Stevie? Right, let's get on with it. It's rather heavy this month, so I'm expecting it to be jam packed with goodies. So. I hope so. Maybe it's full of jam. Yeah, why not? Right. I'm going to go in blind here. I'm going to do a t shirt first. Okay. See, it's a white one. Some sort of newspapery sort of. I think I spotted the word dirt sheet there. It. Yeah. Have a look. Yeah. Turn it round. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what have we got? Ah, the daily dirt sheet. The streak. The, the beast be con go on. You do the it. Beast, the beast conquers the, the beast conquers New Orleans left in state of shock. So it's twenty one and one. The streak is over. Mm. There you go. Yeah. What do you think about that? I like that. I really like that. That's yeah. one of my favourite WrestleMania moments, if not my favourite WrestleMania moment. It's, I have to disagree. That's a huge moment, I if, think. And if he had to be beaten, it should have been his last match. Yeah, yeah, I agree with that. I, I don't think he should have been around after that. No. Well, certainly it, it, uh, a sort of a retirement speech the night after, maybe, but... That should have been it, I think. But mm. Yeah, but yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, well, like I'm that. glad you like it. Yeah, not my taste, but there you okay. go. That's not my crate, so I don't care. <laughs> right, it's one cool T-shirt. Safe from the grabber of doom, anyway. Yeah. Right. What's next? I know there's another one in here. Right, red one. Red, red T-shirts are good. Yep. I like red things. It says omen. Have a look of it. Maybe women. Who knows. Okay. What have we got? Women's wrestling. Women's wrestling and uh, what have we got? We've got Sasha Banks, dollar looking thing. Um, got wacky waving, inflatable, wavy tube uh, men yeah, things. Bailey. Um, Becky Lynch's goggles. Yeah. And what else can we spot? Uh, oh, sh the Charlotte rope. Flair, Charlotte I'm Flair guessing Flair. that's yeah. representing Charlotte Flair. Uh, I think that's it, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's alright. Right. Yeah, it's okay. It's right. mm. Yeah. Okay. It's a t-shirt. It <laughs> is. Oh, I have to say, thus far, I'm not massively okay. impressed, but all right. we'll see. Okay. There's something big in here. Oh. On earth is this? Is it a cup? Yes, it is. Tin cup? It's, it's a tin cup. That's unusual. Um, the Dungeon Coffee House, Calgary, Alberta, Canada. No, that's quite cool. Yeah. I do like that. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Let's have a zoom in. Ooh. Oh, yeah. That's pretty good. Mm. Mm, yeah. Okay. What next? Okay. Oh, small thing. Key ring of some sort. Ah! It's a... What? Bray Wyatt or Wyatt family key ring. Let's see how well we can see that through the followed. I think it says on there. It's got the Bray Wyatt lantern. Followed, yeah. I followed. I, followed. I think that says. Right, okay. Yeah, it's yeah. okay. Yeah. It's printed only on one side, which is a bit cheap. But there you go. Hmm. Alright then. A key ring. Alright. I spotted this just now. I've seen this out and about. It's the new British Wrestling sticker album. Ooh, now that it's is interesting. Very, very cool idea, and I've been wanting to grab hold of this. But am I right in thinking our friend Sebastian Radcliffe is in there somewhere? Yes, I think so. Yeah, I'm sure he's going to post something about yeah. it. Yeah, let's find him. Mm. Actually, no. I think we need to proper look through this, don't we? Who have we yeah. got? It's Interest gaps. Mm, oh, it doesn't say. No. But Irish wrestlers, yeah. English wrestlers, the women of wrestling. What else? Something. <laughs> More sticker gaps. Yeah. I'll just skim through it. Help. Uh, portrait of a wrestler. Whatever that is. 
page is oh, TNT Extreme Wrestling. Yeah. Look, well, it looks like it's much the same all the way through. Yeah. So you don't know who's what until you get it. Until you get the stickers, yeah. Ah, right. Is there a list at the back or anything? No. No. I think did I just see Dougie Williams at the back? Yes, yeah. you did. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. A sticker album. Okay, well, British that's, wrestling sticker album. That's uh, pretty interesting. I'm hoping we get some stickers. I hope it? so. Or is yeah. that utterly pointless? And we it? do. All right. Okay. We like stickers to open. Hmm. Okay. I'm, try, I'm going to try not to tear the top of the stickers off. <laughs> it would be clever. I would be impressed if you do that. Yeah. I will laugh. Heartily. This does mean now that I now have to buy all of the stickers to fill the app. <laughs> yeah. It's more well, stuff let's see, to buy. Here we got. Um. Jamie Sparks. Not aware of her. No, not familiar with her. Uh, okay. Yolo Squad. It's Drew Parker and um, name escapes me now. Well, I don't know. Yeah. Um, Kid Lycos without a mask. I can't remember his name now. That's really bad. I can't remember his name. Never mind. Yeah. Yolo <laughs> Squad. Uh, Leah Owens. Again, I'm not familiar. Scottish, I believe, women's wrestler. Yeah, okay. Yeah. She was on TNA boot camp, I think. Yeah, a lot of people were there, weren't yeah. they? So. Uh, Stevie Xavier from ICW. Mm -hmm. uh, female wrestler Zip, uh, Liberty. D yeah. I'm realising how far behind I yeah. am. <laughs> uh, Lacey Mendes. A name I've seen around. Yeah, not familiar at all. Um, Britain's Most Beautiful. Not sure who the female wrestler is on there, but Nathan Cruz on there. Yep. And Robbie Sola, masked wrestler. Mm. Not familiar with him. Don't know him either. either. Yeah. Well, that's, that's interesting, isn't it? The stickers that go with the album. Okay. So are you going to buy more stickers? I have to now, are not I? Yeah. 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 Don't try and put them back in now. Mm -hmm. Right. How much stuff is left in there? Lots. And I've Good. just spotted something. I've just spotted a DVD I nearly bought the other day. Hooray! It's the PCW What's Next? Uh, best of Prince Devitt and Kevin Steen Ooh. in PCW. Oh, yeah. here we go. <laughs> <laughs> the claw has it. <laughs> That's too good for the likes of you. Um, <laughs> Spring Slam 2013, Kevin Steen versus Chris Travis from the PCW Rumble Show. Okay. Um, mm. Super Show 3, Kevin Steen versus Dean Allmark versus Joey Hayes versus Chris Travis. Um, Kevin Steen versus Dave Mastiff. Kevin Steen versus Chris Travis again. I'd like to see him versus Mastiff. Yes. Yeah. Prince Devitt versus Chris Travis. From Who Dares Wins to 2014 and Spring Slam 2014, Prince David versus Chris Travis. Well, that looks like an incredibly good DVD. DVD. Yeah, so. uh, yeah, like I said, I very, very nearly bought that. Oh, the it's other a shame day. you didn't because uh, then I'd get a free copy. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Very can you happy. forget you've got it and then go and buy it again yeah. so I can have that one? Yeah, so I'm very happy with that. All right, At then. the moment, that's probably my favourite item in I, there. So far. I'd agree with you there. Yeah. Um, I know there's another DVD in there because I just spotted it when I grabbed that one. And okay. it's. Fight Club Pro best of 2015 sampler. Right. Another sampler. I think we got a Shikara one last month. Hmm. Um, so this time round we got the Infinity Finals. Pete Dunn versus Zack Sabre Jr. That'd be an awesome match. Zack made it into made it for the first heats. Yes, the I did see that. Yes, that's, that's superb that's news. Good. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Mark Andrews and Eddie Dennis. Uh, versus uh, the Hunter Brothers from Project mm -hmm. Mayhem 4, which I've seen that match, and it was a very good match. I've oh, seen the Hunter Brothers a few times. Yeah. Um, ladder match, MK McKinnon versus Clint Margera. don't know Clint Margera. I remember yes. MK. Um, sort of a... Very much sort of Tommy Dreamer. Okay. Sort of that sort of style. Mm. Yeah. I like him. Bludgeoning was, kind yeah, of. Yeah, yeah, he's sort of your... I wouldn't, I wouldn't say go as far as Deathmatch, but certainly sort of the style of Tommy Dreamer, I'd certainly mm, say. Hardcore-ish. So, yeah. But I'd not, consider hardcore and Deathmatch yeah. to be separate things. Yeah, but I mean, yeah, yeah, I can agree with that. I was just about to say that there's 
quite a difference. Mm. But yeah, I mean, I'm not a major fan of, of death matches and stuff like that. But it each to their own, I suppose. But yeah, with me, I think sometimes one match like that on a card is fine. Mm. I can't imagine going to a whole show of it because no. you'd just be immune by the end. Yeah. yeah, I think once every now and again doesn't hurt. No. Anything more than that is a bit much for me, I think. Well, I'm not good at getting out of the way, so it's probably not a good <laughs> idea. <laughs> yeah. um, American Wolves versus Mustache yes. Mountain. <laughs> that is okay. uh, Tyler Bate and... Oh, yes, I do remember Tyler Bate. Oh, uh, that's bad. I can't remember his name. You're doing well. You forgot your yeah. name in English was the other day. Yeah. <laughs> um, MK McKinnon versus Tyler Bate. Yep. Uh, and Chris Brooks versus Morgan Webster versus Dan Maloney versus nice. Nixon Newell in a four-way. Okay. So that's very cool DVD. Well, yeah, that sounds good too. Yeah. But so far, I have to say I'm impressed with the DVDs. Yeah. I personally am not impressed with the T-shirts and the cups a nice touch. Yeah. It's weird that it's tin. That's yeah. quite cool. So you can get, <laughs> get all beaten up, I suppose. Yeah. Um, wow. Well. <laughs> okay. Oh, he's struggling. Oh, a lot of prints in here. And that's it. Okay. Well, that right. is a lot of prints. Who have we? I can see We've got, spray because I can read it on the back. They are Turn around. Ringside, ringside perspective prints. Okay. Okay. First of all, Sting. Got a man called Sting. Yeah. That is really nice. Yeah. Oh, that's got a nice old Yeah, they're very satiny they're card. card yeah. Ooh. Nice quality paper print. I like it? that. Look, that would yeah would look well. Oh, Ray Mysterio. excellent Mysterio. Um, Pentagon Junior. Yay! I have become a huge fan of his mm. since Lucha Underground has been a thing. Yeah, I was completely unaware of him, and he's blown me away. He's awesome. Yeah. Um, a lot of you are going to be familiar with Shinsuke Nakamura. Yes. Now he's turned up on. NXT. If you weren't, you should be by yeah. now. Look at his weird faces and yeah. wonky arms <laughs> popping about in funny directions. I, I really hope they use him to the full extent that they yeah, should. They should. Yeah. But then, uh, he is now in the position, I think, to be what Muta should have been mm. in America. Because Muta was the best wrestler in America when he was there. Yeah. I honestly believe that. Mm. And you, if you're that good, you don't need promos. No. And so I think Nakamura, he could do it. Yeah. And he, it's not just because I love Japanese wrestling, but I just think he's got that extra something. Yeah. That like Rita had mm. has in fact. Yeah. Uh, moving on, AJ Styles. Hey, Jason um, Styles. And Will Ospreay. Yes, indeed. That's a really strange picture. It is, isn't it? That makes it look like he's a detective on an yeah. RTV drama. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so that completes... Maybe Will Ospreay is a question. Yeah. Will Ospreay find the killer? Yeah. Who knows? Mm. Well, that completes this month's Wrestle Crate. Mm. So we've got the prints. We've got the Fight Club Pro sampler. Yeah. The DCW but What's Next DVD. That's a bit good, that That's is. far too good for you. Um... And then you got the British Wrestling stickers and sticker album. Mm -hmm. The Dungeon <laughs> Tin Cup, which is very cool. That's uh, good. The Makes you feel. Red Women's Wrestling T-shirt. Mm. Are you actually going to wear that? I think so. Mm. I haven't had a T-shirt yet in a wrestle crate that I wouldn't wear. I don't know. And then, I, I don't think I'd wear either of these. And then the 21 and 1 mm. streak is over t-shirt. Yeah. I like that one better than the, than the red one. Yeah. But yeah. yeah. Mm. I don't know, I kind of think when they've done two... When there's two t-shirts, I think one of them should be a licensed one. Yeah. I don't... I, I know what they're doing, I can yeah. see what they're up to. Yeah. But to I me, th I think you should have had something that... Yeah. Maybe what would have been nice would be to have something Chris Travisy considering. Yes, I and I think that's probably coming to be honest because they. Yeah. I think I, I did spot something, uh, sort of a 
competition y sort of thing where you could design your own t shirt for a future wrestle crate. So Yeah. Um and hopefully I, I I think I did see a couple of designs that some some people had thrown in to do with Chris Travis, so hopefully one of those gets picked. So I kinda wish now that I'd sort of entered something now, but I don't know if I still can, but yeah. But yeah. But can you draw as well as the awesome Uncle Egbert no. t shirt? <laughs> <laughs> it's, my, it's one of my favourite yeah. t shirts ever. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Right. Well, that's, that's this month's Wrestle Crate. That's it for another month. Yeah. So we'll see you next month about this, but we'll see you many times in between if you subscribe and like. Mm. And there's lots of stuff. We've got food stuff, we've got toy stuff, we've got, I don't know, game stuff, stuff, stuff. Yeah. 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 So. Yeah. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>